Hello everybody, it's Brian Lett. I'm coming to you live from DAV's national headquarters in Cold Spring, Kentucky. And the reason for that today is I want to discuss our Field of Flags campaign. It actually started on Flag Day on June 14th. It's its third year running. It will go through September 11th or Patriot Day. And real quick, I'd also like to thank Triple Crown Products who sponsored or helped us, actually, sorry, they matched the first $10,000 that we raised. Off to our right here, it's a little too far for us to show or even really get to, but that's where our field of flags is. There's currently 1,200 flags um, in that field. Each one of those flags represents a gift to DAV of $25 or more. And when you think about that, each dollar donated to DAV represents $40 in direct benefits to veterans. That's $1.2 million that's just off to our right in that field for services for veterans and their families. Now, before we go any further, to my right, I have our national adjutant, Mark Burgess. To my left is our immediate past national commander, Delphine Metcalf Foster. And if you do donate $100 or more, you'll be a part of our National Commander's Package. And what we do then is we will take your flag, we will raise it above on this flagpole at DAV headquarters, and then send that to you as a way of saying thank you for your contribution, a thank you for your support, and also just as a way to just, well, just say thank you. It does so much for veterans and their families. Now, before we leave here today, we will briefly show you one of these flags being raised. But before we get to that, I want to ask our immediate past commander, Metcalf Foster, as a veteran yourself, what does the flag mean to you? Good morning. The flag means to me patriotism for all the men and women who have served this great country. Nope, I understand that one. And then I'm gonna turn my attention to Mark, our national adjutant. The donations that we receive, uh, what type of impact does that have for DAV, veterans, their families, and DAV's ability to continue the services that we provide? Thank you, Brian. Each and every year, DAV helps over a million veterans in life-changing ways. And of course, we can only do that with a generous public. So to have a community out there that's willing to stand up and be counted and recognize the service and sacrifice that the men and women have served it is necessary for an organization like ours to provide those free programs and services. No, I think Mark said it perfectly. And just as a reminder, this does not end until September 11th. Please check out fieldofflags.org. You still have time to donate. And on that note, I'm going to let uh, our immediate past national commander and our national adjutant get one of these flags uh, up on that flagpole. 